sisters cooking with mom dukes because for mother's day you know i got a couple of gifts and everything you know i got a little little bell for my other son you know if y'all don't know that that's td christian D, 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 dior dior christian hmm. okay yeah this is old school because this was out a long time ago okay but it, I, it's, it's a nice spell clearly he was telling me i need to keep my pants on me okay so that was a good gesture from him i, I love it love it thank you Thank you, Mercy. Thank you, Mercy GG. Or whatever you going back now, Lucy, whichever. I'm not for sure right now, okay? It changes. So, even, anywho, it's cooking with Mom Dukes. If you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and subscribe. Go ahead and hit those like buttons. Comment. Feel free. If you got recipes for me to try in my new oyster air fryer, this is a Mother's Day gift as well. Thank you, thank you. Gracias. I've already made so far. Okay, you know, I, it's not nothing like that to be showing. It's just just a little bit of some um, baked potatoes and some uh, mixed vegetables. Now, the mixed vegetables, you know, maybe if I could have it like put a little bit of butter in there with it versus just the oil itself and you know, do it real low, it may turn out even better, but it was still frozen vegetables. I just wanted to, like I said, this is my first time using it. So this is all new to me. So again, go ahead and drop those comments. Let me know if you guys have one. What y'all cooking out of this? Because I'm trying to cook everything, okay? Y'all hear me? Everything. Now I don't have to worry about burning up my banana chips because I have to make them in there. Do y'all, let me show y'all, let me show y'all. See, that's fries. That's some bacon. That's some fish. I think y'all can see from there. If not, it's okay. Shrimp or seafood. We got chicken. We got, um, that look like steak or something. Or pork, maybe. Then, like, dessert. So, you got one for everything and dehydrated. That's what I'm talking about because that's how I'm going to make these banana chips, okay? But, today we're going to be doing, we go with this. We get us there. We're going to be doing some fried chicken. So we're gonna go ahead and get into that chicken button. We got it on 425 minutes. I think I'm gonna start off that way. Okay, now it's real simple. You just pull it, open it up. This is how big the basket is. I've already got my oil in a spray bottle so I can have my oil on hand. And I have all of my seasons. So I don't know if you guys can see all of these, but I'll make sure that I kind of zoom in for you guys. Oh, the basil want to fall. But we have some basil, garlic powder, chicken seasoning, some cayenne, some Cajun, onion powder, regular salt. That's it. That's all we have there. And that's what I've actually placed the seasoning in here with some flour. So that's already there. All I have to do is just mix it up. And I'm, I already have my chicken because I'm making fried chicken. I hear everybody saying, oh my goodness, you gotta have an air fryer. You gotta try your chicken in there fried. Once you have it in there fried, you ain't gonna go back to all that grease and oil. So if this is true, this will be perfect for me. Now my mister, he may still like his deep fried, okay? But if I trick him here and there, he may not notice. But he gonna try it today. He gonna try it with me and we gonna see. And you never can tell. He may be like, damn, this better than the regular chicken. You, you never know. That's what I'm saying. And if y'all hear my babies in the background, guess why? Because I'm in the kitchen. They're in the living room. They're playing. They're doing their little thing. So I might be interrupting their day. I'm not for sure. So if they're interrupting your day, <laughs> I'm really not concerned with that right now. We're still cooking with Mom Dukes. So let me go grab that chicken out the fridge, okay? Okay. So I could kind of tell you everything I did. Didn't have buttermilk, but I had some half and half. That was almost, almost, almost past this date. Buttermilk ain't nothing but spoiled milk. So with that being said, being that it's buttered milk and it's spoiled buttermilk, I could, I mean, this ain't spoiled yet, but it was, it was all, it was there almost. So I figured why waste it? We're gonna use that and utilize it. So we did that with a little bit of some, I want a little like, like zing with my chicken just to see so I put a little bit of Italian seasoning up in there and some regular little seasoning, a little um, chili flakes. 
So with this, what we're going to do, because we're going to be flowering it, it's real simple. Okay, let me go ahead. Now this I normally, I do man. I know a lot of people like to go and get up in there. I guess me and I'm going to utilize the one hand and use it. One hand. It'd be like that. Hey, hey. They didn't understand what you said. What are you talking about? You like to, you just want it to drip, drip off. You don't want it, you know, wet. You don't coat it. And then you just toss it in the flour. Toss it real good. Make sure everything is nice and coated. Now, for me, if I want to make it even crispier, I'm not for sure. I've never tried it. This is my first time. So I'm thinking that I could do this batter recipe with the egg batter recipe and everything. And then let it sit in the refrigerator for a minute. Let it really like marinate up in that. Then put it in here. Like a day before get everything right. That's what I'm talking about. But we're going to see it. Then all you do, you just drop it and put it in the basket. You just want to make sure you got room for everything to circulate. And y'all see I did one piece. But we're going to just go on and take a few out. Because I know I'm pretty good at flowering and doing all that with chicken. So I know that part. The only new part is the machine I'm using. That's it. Okay? So I got these little four pieces in there. I'm gonna go ahead and toss all of them, get them nicely tossed. But we're gonna see how many pieces of chicken wing dings I can put in here because this is like the 5XL or something like that. You know, it's like one big time, you know, we can put it nice big and roll, basically is what I'm trying to get to what I'm trying to say. So thank you, son, again, because this will help him because he's vegan. So this probably be a great too, for him as well to use. And I don't mind anyone in my home using any of my cooking products as long as they treat my cooking products with love just like I do. So if you rough and tough with your shit, don't use my shit. That's that's my mind. Okay, because I don't care. If you're going to cook, and then just cook for everybody. Everybody might be hungry. You know, don't be selfish with it. Sometimes it could be personal dishes, you know, if you want to, but in here in this house, I got grandbabies. And they like to eat and sample and try. They let you know if it's nasty. They tell you, yeah, I don't want it. You know, they, they let you know. They do not sit there and to say it's good if it's not. And they do a humming thing. So that's how you know if it's good. They get to go on. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, that means it's real good. All right, y'all. So we getting kind of to the tip of this basket. I'm going to try to squeeze this other last piece in here. But I may just make it with how it is. So... I'm gonna show y'all so y'all can see. We really were only able to get eight wing dings. Okay, I don't know. If, oh, I don't want to tip it, y'all. Hold on. We're gonna do it a different way. Mm -hmm. All right, so as y'all see, we were only able to get eight pieces in. That's fine, because you see the room that's there? That's what you want. Those little slots, you need that air to circulate. So now, all we do is, we're gonna move all that out the way. We just. Pop that in, thing gonna come on. We already set it where we want it. And the time to start off. Press start, light is on, it's going. And probably like in 25 minutes, it may not be all the way ready, so then I'ma turn it and see. I may check in between, but if not, that's fine, okay? So, I'ma come back, we gonna check it together, and I ain't gonna do y'all how some people probably be doing, like coming back after they done did it twice. No, I'ma let you see in a sense of, this say 25 minutes, so I may come back at about 12. And then if I come back at 12 minutes, we'll see the progress. But I kind of wanted to go the whole 25. So we'll see. They little wings. They look. So that's pretty high heat. But first time. So we'll be back. Okay, y'all. So we got 14 minutes. Or we got, yeah, 14 minutes left. So I want to kind of check it because. Remember, these are like little wings. It's not like whole pieces of chicken, breast, thighs, things of that nature. So, I'm thinking that it's going to be a minute. So, what you want to do is press the power button. That kind of like pauses it to stop your time. And then you just pull it out. And then it's going to stop when you catch back on. I don't know if y'all can see that. Let's see. Y'all hear the sizzle. So, I'm going to spritz them with my oil that I got. And then turn them. You know, get what I'm saying. So you know, just some oil, so they don't, because you don't get the flour. So you want it to crisp. Gonna crisp a little bit on each one. And I don't recommend doing anything with your fingers, y'all. So let me get some utensils so I don't look 
crazy. Don't do how I do, because I've been cooking for a long time in restaurants and so forth. So you know how they always say that you either burn off your hand by chemical, by hot water, or by food, but you know, stuff is happening. That's pretty much where I'm at. So, it sounds good though, y'all. I'm not gonna even hold y'all up. So we're gonna go ahead and turn it. Yes, y'all. It really, y'all, sounds real good. And I think one of these says, I think I already tried to Hey, little girl. Hey, little girl. Go back in there and be quiet. Because they know they grandma babies. I don't care about that. That's why grandma makes stuff for them so that they can have a nice nice things to do. Play area and so forth. You know, get out of grown-ups space and go be kids. And that goes fast so fast. Okay, so we don't flip them over. I don't know what it look or you know, hit the top part a little bit. Just a little bit, just get a little spruce, 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 spruce. Alright, they looking good to me so far. I guess the test is when you do it. When you just press the power button and it picks right back up. You see, right back at 14 minutes. So that's what I mean by I ain't about to do catfish and I'm gonna show y'all because they show you recipes and a lot of people show y'all this stuff. Like this is not a review because I didn't purchase this item. This was given to me as a gift. So my thing is my review is gonna be how good the food tastes out of it if it's beneficial for me. Because you know uh, lockdown quarantine done kind of packed on a little bit of belly fat. So we're gonna have to tighten that up. And I don't do a lot of exercise, so we're gonna try to go food first, then maybe work out. Y'all pray on that, okay? Pray with me on that, because I'm praying on that, okay? And I'm praying. But we're gonna go and let them look 14 minutes do what it do it. I think we're gonna have nice crispy, nice fried chicken. That, that's what I'm that's what I'm doing. So I'ma let that do that. I'ma go ahead and get my next my next batch I go, I'ma wait. Because I got one in there. I'm gonna wait. I'm gonna just we're gonna wait together. How about that? Because my stomach is telling me that she can't wait, but she can wait. So we'll be right back. Okay, y'all saw so that five minutes left, but my nose is telling me something. So we gonna pause that and we're gonna take that out. Oh, she's looking amazing. Okay, so we're going to take her out. We're going to put her on the plate so y'all can see what this looking about. I know y'all like, look at, yeah, I be so organized, y'all. So very organized. Uh, so we're just going to get this one. We're going to get the glass. Then y'all can really see. Baby. Y'all wait for it, wait for it, because uh, I'm really impressed how this looks. But that look, let's put you down a little bit so you can really gather and see. But that looks really good. I mean, this looks like a fried piece of chicken to me. Nice and good. So we're going to get them out. I'm doing them. Tip your chicken, but these little chicken wings. Your nose tell you, because back in the day they didn't have that. So I do everything like I would think back in the day if you would lose everything. Everything that you normally had that was easy for you to do things were gone. What would you do? That might be a good thing for cocktails conversation. I'm just saying, but. Y'all see the steam. Y'all see that steam. They're really good. Damn. Okay, y'all. So, for mom do sponsor. You know, this is my daughter, so she can take a little bite by taste. Because she's going to tell me, too. But, you know, you. Mm, mm, I didn't almost want to even give that to her. Mm, nice and hot. Ooh. Ooh. I mean. Damn it, we had fried chicken. We had fried chicken. Yes. Okay. 
So from Mom Duke's castle to two castle in your kitchen, we about to thank you for looking out and saving me some. We about to go ahead and have dinner, okay? Cause mm, I'm gonna do the other now ones in, and baby, it's it's a wrap, okay? So from Mom Duke's castle again in my kitchen. I guess the go. Sister girl hungry and it's good. I gotta go feed the mister. Okay, y'all. You know, I gotta go. So I don't know about y'all. I don't know what y'all trying to do. But if y'all know, like I know. Remember, I didn't purchase this. But if you trying to watch what you eating, and you trying to eat healthy, baby, go and get your air fryer. I ain't gonna hold the goddamn it. Shit. I mean, mm. Get your air fryer. That's all I'm gonna say. So, I'm gonna go ahead and put it in because I know y'all don't wanna watch me mm, eating all of y'all face, but mm, y'all yeah, don't even see how I clean bones. That's for sure. So, Mom Do said gracias. Gracias for tuning in. Thank you guys. Your support and your love is always welcome here. So, don't forget, don't forget to tell a friend, to tell that friend. That mom Duke over here doing it because she got to go because her nose is running. So Deuce is, I'm out. <laughs>